our seven and apostle was born in a small village in Chipinge that is called Ngaone on 5 May 1923 and is passed on as he was promoted to glory on 5 July 2023. So one day when his mother went to the shops, he met a preacher who preached to her about Jesus, about where the sinners would go and where the righteous would go. So this troubled her so much that she couldn't keep it keep it in her heart she had to go back so that she can teach the same news to her sons children where had gone um, there was a preacher who came to talk to us and he was talking about living right and that those who live in sin and do not live according to the laws and precepts of the almighty God will burn for eternity in a big lake of fire lake of called, fire yeah a big lake of fire called hell and they will burn for eternity, and they will burn for eternity. So he was just encouraging us to live right. I want to tell you, my sons, you do not want to burn for eternity. Hmm. You should live right. Yes, yes, you know what is it? Good morning. Hello, Angela. Good morning. Uh, How are I'm, you? I'm, I'm not okay. The story you told me yesterday about hell, about leaving earth and going to hell, it struck my heart. I could not sleep. Uh, do you know where I can find a preacher who can explain to me about these things you just told, you told me yesterday? You know, in this region that we live in, there are no preachers. I don't think there's anyone who would know in the whole of Ngaone here. Oh, not even one. You do not know what happened yesterday night. I could not sleep. And anyways, it's okay, man. Mm. Okay. Go on, my son. Okay. So after figuring out that there was no help that he could get from his mother or from the people in the Gawani village, he was confused and he wanted to know this creator. He wanted to know more about Jesus Christ. He wanted to know more about where he would go after he leaves this planet. So he went out in the bushes and sat under a tree. fire creator creator ah if you are there save my soul creator no no lick of fire hell no 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 creator no no! <laughs> Look up. No! No! <laughs> and as he cried to a creator he had not yet known, this is where it is where he writes in his books that I met God before 
I met a preacher. So he did this several times. Sometimes you'd go and lay on a rock crying to the Lord, crying for a creator he had not yet known, crying for a savior he had not yet known. Other times you go again on the rock and lay facing down, still on crying to the Creator for an answer, for a sign. So one day as he was praying, just like all the days he used to go back in the bushes so that he can look for God, he can search for Him. He heard a voice. Be And one of the days when he was praying in the bushes, he heard angels singing sweet melody songs. So he later on met a man Thank you for coming. who would help him receive Jesus Christ as his personal Savior and Lord. I see power being filled in you. But for you to receive that, you need God. You need to seek ye the kingdom. For you to receive God, you need to accept God in your life. It is written in John 3.16. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whoever believes in him shall not perish but have everlasting life. You will have everlasting life if you believe in him. Believe. Believe. The son Jesus believe. to die for us. To die for us and save us from our sins. So he received Jesus Christ as his personal savior and Lord and was born again. It was up until then that God showed him the man who would baptize him. His name was Enoch Kwanzura. And so he later met the man and then he got baptized. So he was later encouraged by the Spirit of God to read the whole Bible. So he did so. He read the whole Bible from Genesis to Revelation, following the Word of God. So one day, as he was praying with a certain young man in cottage 593, the angel of the Lord appeared. Yeah. 
And upon the appearing of the angel of the Lord, the man he was praying with ran under the bed because of the glory. But he continued to praise God. And then the Lord God spoke to him as he was sleeping. He showed him many stars and told him that he will lead many people to Christ and you have a church that will be over nations of this planet. Repent, my brothers. Repent, it was my up until then that he started yes, his ministry under a gum tree. Okay, so I just want to give a small word of prayer. Let's bow our heads. Coming down, down, coming down.